And to commitment 2024 coverage now, President Joe Biden makes a quick trip to Milwaukee today. The president visiting the swing states of Wisconsin and Pennsylvania. His focus here, clean drinking water. The president landed at Mitchell International Airport at about 1230. Congresswoman Gwen Moore, Milwaukee Mayor Cavalier Johnson, County Executive David Crowley, and Lieutenant Governor Sarah Rodriguez were among those on the tarmac to greet him. The president in town talking about replacing lead pipes. One is Hannah Hilliard is live at 40th and Wright. Hey, Hannah, that's where crews are tackling the very problem the president addressed today. All right, Deanna and Kristen. So crews spent much of the day today using this heavy machinery to dig up underneath the roads as well as the sidewalks here along 40th Street to replace these lead lines. But 65,000 lead lines still remain here in the city. And the president says Milwaukee now has 10 years to replace them all. A Milwaukee mom as a mother of four. It is terrifying to learn about who's seen the problem and a local laborer. This is hard work, but it is so rewarding trying to fix it. These two welcomed President Joe Biden to Milwaukee Tuesday. It's kind of surreal, but I still don't believe it happened. As the president put the pressure on cities to get rid of all lead pipes. I'm announcing a new rule written in the law from the Environmental Protection Agency that requires water systems across America replace lead pipe service and every single one in America within 10 years must be done. Replacing the pipes that can leak poisonous toxins into water has already been a priority in Milwaukee. The announcement being here is confirmation that we are on the right track. But with 65,000 lead pipes yet to replace, the city estimated it would take upwards of 60 years to get the job done. Today, the president is demanding it be done in 10. How is that possible? Well, primarily due to funding. So 60 years was the timeline when we started back in 2017 and we were replacing about a thousand lead services a year. This year we've expanded to hopefully we'll get close to 2500. An ambitious goal with an $800 million total price tag. The bipartisan infrastructure law has helped cover about 13% so far, but simply put, there will be more funding needed. Hannah, President Joe Biden did announce additional money with this new deadline. Right, Deanna, $2.6 billion for cities across the country. And Waterworks here in Milwaukee is hopeful they'll be able to secure some more money. Otherwise, the cost will fall on utility and taxpayers to keep the pace. Hannah Hilliard reporting live for us in Milwaukee this evening. A quick recap for you. According to Milwaukee Water Works, the superintendent, there were more than 70,000 lead service lines in the city. 65,000 remain today. Crews hope to replace as many as 2,400 more this year. And 12 News has done several investigations on this long-running battle to replace lead pipes in Milwaukee. You can watch those past reports right now on the 12 News mobile app.